everybody and welcome back. Thanks for joining your virtual drinking buddy. So on the menu tonight I've got Lucky Bucket Light. It's a blonde ale and let me read on the side here. If you want a good easy drinking beer here's what you need. This beer is delicious, refreshing, and crisp. That's it. No analysis or rating required. It's 4% alcohol by volume. It has 109 calories, 8.3 grams of carbohydrates. So, it's not low carb, but calorie count isn't terrible. Um, and all they had on their website was that it's 4% alcohol by volume. I'm actually pretty excited to drink this beer. I've been holding on to it for a while, and I've had a few other of the Lucky Bucket beers. I haven't had this one yet. Um, so without further ado, cheers. Mm. Mm, that's good. <laughs> it's definitely a lighter beer, um, texture-wise, body-wise, whatever. Um, very light in that department. I'm gonna have another drink though, because I'm just tasty. It has a, a slightly sweet finish that I can't quite place. It's not a malty sweetness, but it's not really, I wouldn't say fruity. Hmm, I better have another drink. We should probably just pound this thing down. Maybe go get six more and just keep drinking until I come up with it. You'll wait, won't you? Hmm. You know, the sweetness that I was tasting, it's gone now. It could be that I just finished up another video where I was drinking a fruit flavored beer and I finally got the the flavor rinsed away because what I'm tasting now is like a a light maltiness like a a bready maltiness but it's real light it's not um it's not overly present but it, it is a great beer it'd probably be a great beer for warm weather um not necessarily this time of year since we're getting into fall, but I mean, you can drink this whenever. Um, and it, you know, it's a light beer, so it would go well with a lot of different food types. I'm not even going to get into it because it would be probably be easier just to actually, I don't even know if it'd be easier to come up with a list of foods that it wouldn't pair well with. Um, so yeah, if you're looking for a light beer with a little different flavor than your macro brood domestics this is probably the way to go um let's get a, a good look at the label lucky light by lucky bucket brewing company they're out of omaha nebraska oh a little bit of beer left in there maybe a little bit of sediment at the bottom pour the rest of that out and yeah excuse me how terribly crude so I swirled the bottom around and there's a little bit of sediment there. I don't know if that's necessarily intentional. I know some beers um, are brewed that way and they're almost applauded for that. So let's see if it tastes any different now. No, it still tastes delicious. You know, if anything, almost picking up like banana. So I don't know if that's the case, but maybe. So you know what, if you want to find out, maybe go and pick up some Lucky Light for yourself and try it out. That's really all I got. And this is the Malted Gentleman reminding you, you only have one liver, so use it wisely.